You're watching EAC News. Thanks for joining us. While speaking at the groundbreaking ceremony for the nearly 150 km road expansion of National Road No. 48 in Kokon Province, which is to be built from a concessional loan from the government of South Korea, Prime Minister Hun Sen thanked the South Korean government for also showing interest in helping building a bridge over the Mekong that will connect the capital city, Phnom Penh, to the island of Areik Sad. Also speaking at the ceremony was the South Korean ambassador to Cambodia, Park Hyun Kyun, who said the decision to build the Cambodian-Korean friendship bridge was in response to the previous open request of Prime Minister Hun Sen made during the groundbreaking ceremony for National Road No. 2 and No. 22 in February 2020. According to the ambassador, a Korean company has already conducted a feasibility study and recently submitted a report to the Cambodian government and based on this report, the government will decide on the construction site and the format of the bridge. He added that many Koreans are very happy that the Cambodian-Korean Friendship Bridge project across the Mekong River in Phnom Penh has received the interest and participation of the royal government of Cambodia. I believe that the Cambodia-Korea Friendship Bridge will not only contribute to alleviating traffic congestion in the center of Phnom Penh for the next 100 years, but will also become a tourist attraction in Phnom Penh, especially if this Cambodia-Korea Friendship Bridge is built as a beautiful capital state bridge. All Koreans living in Cambodia will commit to travel to Phnom Penh again to see the completed bridge for sure. In addition to improving the traffic flow in the capital city and serving as a landmark for tourism, the ambassador added that the bridge will also become a symbol of the continuation and strengthening friendship between Korea and Cambodia. According to the Minister of Public Works and Transport, Senior Minister Sun Chantol, the construction of the Cambodian-Korean Friendship Bridge might begin its construction this year. Relations between Cambodia and South Korea have been growing stronger recently, especially with the recent passing of the draft bilateral Cambodia-Korea Free Trade Agreement by the National Assembly on 29 December. The draft law will be sent to the Senate for a vote next, and if passed, will then return to the National Assembly to be signed by the King or Acting Head of State to officially become established as law. <laughs> 